happy new month. So today we are going to tour this road. Uh, this is Chebilat Ikonge Chebera Road. It's a shorter route from uh, Sotik to Chebera. Uh, if you are going to Homa Bay County, Migori County, this is a, a, a scenic uh, route to use. This area is in Mogusi. Mogusi is in Nyamira County. Uh, Nyamira County is in uh, former Nyanza province. And then uh, this area is divided by the, the road, divides it from a uh, rift valley. So the other side is rift valley, and then the other side is in Nyanza. I hope you enjoy the video. Hi guys, you have been asking me to show you places out of Nairobi where vloggers rarely go or show. So today I want to show you this place in Nyamira County, former Nyanza province. But first, like this video. This helps with YouTube algorithm. Also, it helps me to know if you guys like me showing you this type of videos. So like this video first, then continue watching. I will focus on the new road, the Chabilat Ikonge Chabera Road in Nyamira County, Nyanza Province, and the tea farming production in Nyamira County, Nyanza Province, and the whole Kenya in general. It will be an amazing video, so don't go anywhere. County is a county in the former Nyanza province of Kenya. It was formerly known as Nyamira district separate from Gucha and Kisi districts which were merged in 2013 to form Kisi county. The main cash crops grown in Nyamira county are bananas and tea as you can see here. The county has a population of about 600,000 people. The major trading centers are Nyamira, Keroka and Nyasiongo. The 37.5 km Chebilat Ikonge Chebera B133 road was commissioned by President Uru Kenyatta in 2020. This road is located in Nyamira County along the existing Chebilat Ikonge Chebera road, formerly C22. The road starts at Chebilat Junction with Sotik Kisi Road near Sotik and runs in a northwesterly direction crossing the Kisi Mosit Road at Ikonge. The project also includes a 7.5 km access road to Nyamusi sub county headquarters. The project is approximately 45 km with a 9.5 meter wide carriageway. The road forms an important link with the counties of Bomet, Nyamira, and Kisumu. The road has reduced travel time to Kisumu County, 
Homa Bay County, Migori County, and other areas in the western region. This road has enhanced agricultural activities and access to markets in this region. This is a game changer in Nyanza province. Chepilat Ikonge Chebera Road has some of the most spectacular views in Kenya with the tea gardens, tall trees, beautiful rolling hills, farmland and charming villages, a place to get away from the hustle and bustle of the city life. <music> is simply amazing. Thank you. 
now talk about the tea. Kenya claims the accolade of the world's top black tea producing country. With teas grown in the Kericho region, the Nyambene Hills, Nyamira, Kisi and Nandi region. Tea comes from the evergreen leaves of the shrubs or small trees called Camellia sinensis. The different taste, colors and flavor depends on the location and climate the tea is grown in and also in the way the tea is processed. Tea grows well when the climate is warm and there is plenty of rain. The Tea History in Kenya Tea was first introduced in Kenya from India in 1903 by the Kane brothers and was planted in the present-day Limuru, near Nairobi. Since 1924, Kenya has become a major producer of black tea. Currently, Kenya is the largest tea producer in Africa and the third largest producer in the world and is also the largest exporter of tea to the United Kingdom. Almost all tea bags from major brands in the United Kingdom are blended with Kenyan tea leaves. Kenyan tea is also one of the top foreign exchange earners, alongside tourism, horticulture, and the Kenyan coffee. Comment in the comment box and tell us. Are you a tea or coffee person? Unlike almost any other plant, good tea has to be picked by hand. Any machine will ruin the leaves, therefore the next time you drink a cup of tea, feel thankful to the person who carefully picked every leaf, rolled them, and tended them while they dried. This drink was crafted by human hands rather than by some impersonal machine. <music>
Mombasa in Kenya is the largest tea auction in Africa and the second largest black tea auction center in the world after Colombo in Sri Lanka. Unlike India and Sri Lanka, where tea is seasonal, production in Kenya is all year round. <music> Ninety percent of uh, people viewing my videos have not subscribed. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell to get a notification of all my videos. Overall, the Chebilat Ikonge Chebera Road is awesome with some of the most amazing views in Kenya. It is hard to believe this is in Nyanza. The county government of Nyamira or Kenya should construct several rest areas along the road for road users. The government should build more rest areas along major roads and highways in Kenya with better facilities like washrooms, running water, shops, information desks and wireless internet. This will make traveling safer and more comfortable, especially for those who need to drive long distance or to stop to enjoy Kenya. Kenya offers some of the most dramatic sunsets. Enjoy! Thank you very much for watching.